Okay guys, there's a few things I want to see in Hellboy 3. I think there's about four or five reasons I'd like, five things I want to see in Hellboy 3. The number one reason, I want to see it fucking happen, for fuck's sakes. Warner Brothers can fork out money for how many reboots of Batman? Five bat reboots of Batman they have done. Sony Pictures, they've rebooted uh, Spider-Man. This is the third time they're rebooting Sp Spider-Man with Marvel Studios. The first two, second one series did well. First one of Tom McGuire sucked, but they still won't fucking fork out movie for a money out for Hellboy three. Yes, Guillermo del Toro is asking him a little bit more than he usually asks for for a Hellboy movie. He's asking for a hundred and fifty million, and I know the last ones was like ninety two million dollars to make, but there's more to this final film that he wants to do to complete the story. Put out the fucking money, Warner Brothers, even Universal Studio. Warner Brothers, Stu Sony, Universal Studios, or 20th Century Fox, put, give help Guillermo del Toro finish his Hellboy story. And a few things I'd like to see in this Hellboy story final is, the second thing I would like to see is I would like to see um, Hellboy have two sons, around 12 or 13 years old, in this Hellboy 3. Because in the second movie, at the end, they, him and Liz are talking at the very end of the film. He's talking about how he's excited about this baby and she gets him to his attention and he says two babies so she's having twins and I'd like to see it happen but I'd like to see him have two sons around 12 and 13 in this final film it'd been a perfect age because t teenagers don't really listen but because his dad is pretty cool and doesn't listen either maybe they listen to their dad I want to see that happen 12 to 13 year old sons maybe looking like their dad a little bit fighting alongside their, their, their dad in this final film. Um, this is, another thing that I would like to see in this this film is I would like to finally see Hellboy and Liz get married in this Hellboy film. I'd actually like to see that happen in the, the final film. Liz and Hellboy getting married. It would be awesome. Um, for the third thing in this thing, fourth, third thing in this film, I would like to see Hellboy finally fucking hit Manning in the face. I would absolutely love to see Manning get hit in the face. I absolutely hate that agent leader in this. I'm kind of upset that his dad died um, by John Hurt in this at the end at the end of the end of the the first film. But yeah, they could do a cameo at the very beginning. I think they should do a cameo at the very beginning with him returning. Uh, the fourth thing I'd like to see in this film, I. I I want to see the villains uh, Herman von Kelp and his mechanical ape army, and I'd like to see the 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 vampire Vladimir Grachu from the comic Wake the Devil. Um, I think they'd be perfect villains for Hellboy three in it, a vampire and a mad scientist Nazi. Uh, the fifth thing I'd like to see in this movie, I would like to see a tw ten minute or twenty minute scene at the very beginning where Hellboy is confronting. Adolf Hitler in World War Two, beating the shit out of him. Him and Adolf are having like a gunfight or something like that. That'd be pretty cool, having it. But I, most th the most thing that I really like to see this about Hellboy Three is it actually fucking happening. Come on, studios, wake up! Stop making all these remakes of previous movies that are have already done been done. And stop rebooting comic book movies. Put the money, the hunt, give Guillermo del Toro $150 million to make a continuation, the final film to his Hellboy franchise. Make it a trilogy. That's final. There's no more after that. It's just three films that he wanted to do in the first place. Make it happen. Wake up, studios. I'd like to hear other people's ideas on Hellboy 3. What would you guys like to see in Hellboy 3? Comment below.